this is Rita. Welcome to my channel. <laughs> Today I am going to show you what I bought. I went crazy. This was um, way before the virus went viral. So I ordered and uh, I shouldn't have. I have so much yarn. It's unbelievable. But before I show what I bought, I wanted to talk about this uh, Lost in Time shawl. Okay. Um, as you can uh, search it up, there's uh, so many people who's doing a tutorial on how to crochet this because it is a very difficult uh, uh, pattern. And uh, so I thought, I didn't even bother uh, messaging the designer, so I thought it would be okay because there's other people that are doing in Turkish, Spanish, Russian, in different uh, languages, so I thought it would be okay. Well, I should have messaged her before so I did a tutorial and this took me like uh, almost 10 days to finish it because it is complicated and it uh, it is like all uh, puff stitch, stitch popcorn stitches and uh, I did uh, I did the tutorial and I posted I only had like uh, 200 views and it looks like someone went and complained so uh, the designer messaged me I had she asked me to put it down because it's uh, copyright and i was like wow okay then well, how come there's others that has been on youtube for years and they have over 100 200 300 thousand views and i only have less than 200 so i don't know i said okay i no problem i'll just uh, put it down so i just kept it for myself if i need to go back it would just be for myself so i unfortunately i, I had to unlist it i didn't delete it because uh, it is very difficult and the pattern, uh, like I'm not a good, I don't have, I ha I really have a hard time reading patterns. So I just wanted to point that out. I had to remove it this morning. I was, like, I was shocked. And I, I pointed out there's others and how come you're, and she said uh, I do message everyone. So, you know, I thought, okay, that would be no problem for me. But uh, I've been getting messages like, where's that video that you posted? So I just wanted to point out because due to, uh, uh, pattern even it's free she said you can't make a tutorial well like uh, I'm not gonna make money out of it because I don't make I don't have that many views on my uh, videos as you can see if you go and check at it check at it uh, I don't have that many views but uh, anyways so I wanted to point out I had to unlist it the lost in time show and you can go and check on Ravelry if you type it it come pops up but uh, I had to remove it because of that. And uh, this is a lesson learned. I will never, ever, ever do that again with any written patterns. Uh, I can make my own, which I owned. I designed my own and I don't write patterns. So it's not a big deal for me. It's just crochet, stitch, single crochet, double crochet, like everyone knows. And then you make these stitches up. So um, I just don't want to get into trouble. So I removed it. <laughs> okay. So let's go back. I know it is nice. People are asking me what yarn. It's uh, May um, Mayflower 3. I think they're sold out. Hobie, I bought it from Hobie and I do have opening yarn opening. So uh, this was way back in, I believe, uh, January, December. I bought the yarn just for this. I bought it. But unfortunately, yeah. Okay, so let's go back what I bought. Oh my goodness. I received a, a discount code from Hobium from Turkey. I went crazy. So I know I try not to go over $20, but I did. So I, that's what I did is I went and I did a big purchase. Well, it's not a 300, 400 purchase, but it, it's for me, it's a big purchase. Okay, everything's falling down. Let me just fix this. So they send me a bag. The bag is here. <laughs> and then, uh, uh, I'm trying to do uh, uh, stuff animals, so I bought eyes because I can't go to AliExpress. They're not shipping. I had to cancel one of my orders because they haven't shipped it over a month. So I just went and canceled it. And uh, I will do tutorials. So I bought two just in case. If I need more, I can always go. And uh, this is the bag. So happy. I think when you spend over $50, you get this bag. I can put my yarn in it. <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, I bought blue, blue eyes. I bought black eyes. I want to do a uh, Star Wars. I, I'm not. I don't think we're uh, supposed to say the name. I know it's odd, but uh, do it. And then this is a gift, I believe, because I did not uh, purchase this. And there are buttons. These will be perfect for baby, uh, baby uh, things that I knit. And you're wondering what this is. These are my circular, cir 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 circular needles that I hang. So I, it's always there. Okay, so I'm going to make a Oilers uh, bl baby blanket. So stay tuned for that. It's going to be Oilers. So I'm trying to collect the yarn. And I'm going to use cotton blend yarn. So I bought the navy. I have the orange. I bought three just in case. So if I use up three, 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 it would be a, like an afghan. We'll see how it's going to work out. Okay, so uh, this is cotton blend and it is uh, yarn art. Yarn art and I believe it's a four weight. It says it's a three weight, but it looks like it's a four weight. And it is nice and soft because I touched these ones when I was in Turkey. So I know uh, it's a 55% cotton and 45% acrylic, I believe. It, they wrote it in the Ukrainian or Russia. Can't read it, but uh, that's what it, that's what it is when I was there. And I bought another cake because I want to make a card again. I was going to use this pattern, but I guess I'm not allowed to gonna make my own so I'll try to figure something else so anything that is a written pattern don't do tutorials or else you will be in trouble yeah so I bought another this was when I received the 30% uh, discount I think this was $16 it went down to 11 American so I grabbed another ball just in case so I'm waiting for another sale I might grab another one because green does look good on me. That's what everyone's saying. <laughs> and with the purple, well, this one does not have purple, but it has a teal. And I'm sure it will look good on me. So what do you guys think? Yeah. Anything that green, because I have all of skin. Okay, now, now let's go here. I am going to make that uh, Star Wars, uh, uh, that little tiny uh, creature. So I'm going to make the tutorial. I'm not going to follow any pattern, so I don't want to be in trouble. I'm going to make my own. So uh, I bought this. These are cotton blend. So I bought two just in case. And I bought for the for, for the jacket that that creature is uh, wearing. Ah, I think uh, everyone's calling it uh, space, out of space creature. We're not supposed to use the name. Okay, Oops. Ooh, fell down. Okay, so these are cotton blend. It's the same yarn as uh, as uh, Jean. It's yarn art. It's just a brand name. Like when you go to Ice Yarn, Ice Yarn is a brand name, and the uh, yarn art is a brand name. So just to point that out. But I went and I touched it, and I felt it, and I'm looking for hundred gram, and. Uh, I want to use cotton for baby stuff. I'm trying to stay away from 100% acrylic, but sometimes you can because they are pretty lovely. And I bought these. I bought three balls of this. It's Mercerized yarn because it's green. <laughs> I love green. I, lime green is my favorite color. So I already had two. I was going to make a hat and I, I didn't have time, but I don't think this is appropriate for a hat, summer hat to make. Uh, let, maybe I can make something else out of this. So I'm just, you know, when I have, when I see sales, I'm just trying to fill out the cart so I won't to go over. I think I paid $16 for shipping. So I don't want to go over. So I just fill in as I go. And uh, I bought three more of this. And every time I go, I will buy just to, you know, stack, to stack it up uh, until I try to figure out what to make. And then I, I paid it and I said, oh my God. I forgot these <laughs> so uh, for this I paid ten dollar for this tiny bag and but what's in it what's in it I'll show it. oh I forgot my bag where is my bag I'll just grab my bag I bought another bag a peach color bag 
here's my other bag. This went down to five dollar five seventy seven. Oh my goodness, isn't it? That's lovely. So I can put my uh, whips in it. Well, I just stack some yarn here. It's not that big, but I just love it. It looks nice. I'm gonna wait for another sale, and I have a there's a um, a quack color that I really like, and. Uh, I don't think I explained much about this yarn, but I did on my previous uh, yarn opening. So this is, uh, okay, this one had 800 millimeter of yarn, which was not enough to finish the shawl. So I had to, I used and I made tensils. So I had to use up a different yarn that I bought from Hobby, which uh, I know it's really hard to see, but I can see it, which I thought, oh no, this isn't good. So, um, I mean, the pattern said I can use up 700 to and over, but it, it's not enough because it, it does use up a lot of yarn. And it's not that big. It's only 25 inches long, so it's not a big shawl. Okay, for this one, this one has 1,000 meter in it, and it's Etrophil Organic El Urgiplik Deri. So a uh, puzzle, it says. El Urgiplik Deri means a hand knitted yarn or thread and this one is 55% of 55% uh, organic cotton and 45% anti-pilling so when I was crocheting with this it did split a lot so I, I haven't tried this yet and I'm hoping how would this would turn out but I will do a tutorial that's my main thing I do the tutorials for you guys to see it and then uh, you can go from there or else why would I do a tutorial and then it would be a referral for me to go back and because I forget what I do right and then I can see what how I did it so that's the main reason I started this channel okay so ice yarn I have this uh, yarn that I've been looking for and they always been sold out so I as soon as I got the email that it's back I ordered it but it's not the same color as it was in the in their website so I was so disappointed with this arrived like in the picture was more a lot or other more a lot I think I bought it once so it's not the same yarn that I bought it before uh, so I'm not gonna go back and buy this yarn again and they put this color as showing as new and they're selling it so they just send me this what they had so I was kind of disappointed. What can you do? So I, I'm going to make something out of this. I'm not going to go back and buy more. As, uh, and uh, this yarn is new as well. So I ordered a bag and I did tutorials already about it. Uh, towel holders. Um, what did I do? I did a couple of uh, uh, teething for babies. It's called cotton uh, pastel and uh, this one is and I think they're sold out they don't sell this anymore so it's really hard to crochet that's what I noticed but the colors are beautiful it's just gorgeous it's 77% cotton 23% acrylic and it's a four weight it's nice it's not I'm not saying it's bad but it is hard to crochet because of because of the bumps if you look into the yarn has uh, bumps oh it's hard to see but uh, yeah you can see it right you can see it it has those bumps makes it hard to crochet okay and uh, I'm on a velvet because I'm, I'm I made hats I did a tutorial tutorial so I thought oh and it looks nice and the yarn that I used was uh, in the tutorial it was a burnet velvet so i felt said to myself let me just do some multiplication so what i did is i ordered yarn from ice yarn because i'm kind of hesitate in the old days uh, the velvet yarns were very hard not soft at all but compared to this this is super soft burnet so i ordered it through a uh, yarn because uh, they had a thinner yarn uh this is a four percent chanel light I ordered it, but it's it's not soft at all when you compare it to Burnett. So no, no, I'm not going to order it back. So I, what I did is, Michael sent me a 50% coupon, 
And then what they did is they said, uh, buy two and get one free for Burnett uh, Velvet. I said, yeah, yuppie. <laughs> so, uh, uh, this was a couple of weeks ago. So I went and I bought two. And I bought the third one for free. I said, yay! And I'm trying to make a animal doll dolls. So I'm planning to do that for my um, tutorials in the future, near future. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe. And I see you if you do subscribe. When I look at the comments, I see a... a, a I'm going to show it to you. Maybe not now, but I see this red uh, thing that shows when you subscribe to me. Like right now, I, I received a message that said, I, I subscribe to you, but no, you haven't because you don't have that red mark. I can see that you, so you don't have to lie about it. I can see it. And I noticed that people that I sent yarn, they never subscribe to me. So life is a big karma. If you haven't subscribed and then I sent you yarn, it's not nice. So don't lie about it. Life is karma, right? That's all I'm going to say. Okay, so what I did is, and then they said, uh, and I uh, knit for homeless. So I came home and uh, I didn't check. I just grabbed those velvets and I came home. And then uh, I saw these, I think it was another week. So I saw these uh, Bernat baby blanket. They were buy two, get one free. Just like this. So I went to, um, I live in Edmonton, and I went to the one in Clairview. The girl said, no, they're not. She gave me this attitude. Oh, this was like a couple of weeks ago, well, two weeks ago. She gave me, gave me this attitude, and I'm like, what? I saw it in your, uh, I got an email. And I didn't have my cell phone with me to show it to her. So anyways, I came home, and I got an email. It said, if we order $54.00 you get free shipping. So I was so mad at her. I ordered and I got one for free and I ordered some, but still they, it's on its way. I think it's coming this Friday. So I said to myself, no, I can't wait. I can't wait. You know, you have that thing. So I went and I bought these and I told the guy and he said, no, but it's to buy two, get one free. So I don't know why that cashier did that to me. So, uh, Maybe I should complain, but who's going to bother, right? And uh, I I saw this yarn. I think this is new. I just love the color. It says velvet strips. So, uh, and then I can use colors if I want to make hair scrunchies or if I want to make a hat. I can go work with that. Like, uh, I bought another ball. Yeah, you, you, when you order, it takes time. Even it's coming from Pure Leader, I thought, wow, that's pretty long. Because I bought this last week and still not here, so Friday's day. So, and I went and bought this, and I had a 50% coupon. So I went to a couple of Michaels and I bought these for half price. Aren't they lovely? Yeah, I went overboard. Yeah. And then uh, Superstores used to sell $8.88 or $0.78. Cents. I went there and then the price went up to $10.48. And, uh, so I had a points there at Superstore. I have a PC card. So I used up that $10 just to get, get it free, you know, just to use it up. And that's what I did. I did so I'm, I'm on the velvet thing right now. I don't know why. But uh, I want to make hats. I want to... For mostly for the homeless and uh, or animal uh, dolls I want to crochet and uh, I thought these color would be nice for uh, dolls uh, rabbits we'll see and then uh, this was on sale half price so I bought this I have another ball at home I might make a baby blanket with this so I'll share the tutorial so I bought a couple of these but uh, on the website they didn't have them so what I bought is I bought baby a uh, blanket on the uh, online when I did uh, shopping. But shipping takes long, so you know we're used to with Hobium and Ice Yarn. It comes in ten uh, three days. I can't wait ten days for it to arrive. So I went and did lots of shopping, and um, yeah, 
And I bought another one of this because this was, uh, I had a 50% coupon. So I think I went a couple of times. Yeah, I was so mad at her. Like the girl wouldn't give me those yarn. Uh, these, uh, she wouldn't give me the Burnett baby velvet nor the uh, Burnett blanket. She wouldn't like even these yarns and then I had others like it was over a hundred dollar but she wouldn't so she lost a customer I don't know why she would do that like why would you do that and the store I was the only one in the store there were nobody maybe she was mad at me because I was out it wasn't that the strict then you know it was because I went early because in early there's not many people out there so I just wanted to share what I'm up to I'm pretty good uh, other than uh, we, me and my husband, we got the flu. I don't know how. Well, I went out shoveling. Maybe that's why I, I kind of got sweaty. But um, so far, we're okay. Everyone's asking me. Like, I got a couple of messages. How are you? It's nice to see you. It's nice to see, hear your voice. Because I haven't taped for uh, a couple of days because I was working on this. And I was taping and my megabyte was full. So I couldn't uh, tape another video to uh let you know that i'm okay but i am okay and uh i just want to share i have lots of tutorials coming up and uh just wanted to let you guys know so stay home stay safe in turkish evde call they have that tag everyone's trying to stay home try to stay healthy healthy and uh so we can uh, slow down this virus it won't spread as it as much as it should should shouldn't be now right now it's, it's it's scary yeah thank you very much happy crocheting happy knitting because i'm going to be crazy busy <laughs> and if you don't hear from me just check my instagram i usually post there try to post there every day and uh, happy crocheting, happy knitting, and take care. Stay home, stay safe, wash your hands. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> happy birthday to you. And then, uh, yeah, take care. That's all I'm going to say. And uh, happy knitting, happy crocheting.